Uh, hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Once again, my name is Brandon. I'm an acting coach. And today I'm jumping back into Chinchilla, somebody I haven't actually done on her own yet. I haven't looked at any of her content. That's just hers. I've reacted to a couple of songs that she duetted with Ren on. And I didn't notice at the time, but I just happened to stumble across this today. And it kind of freaked me out. So I just wanted to, can you, can you, can you see that? Look at that. She says, thank you so much for this video. So nice to watch. Appreciate the reaction and support and understanding of it all so much. That's incredible. That's amazing. So do you know what? I can't, I can't not go back and look at some of her music now. I just can't. That's incredible. She really is awesome. She's amazing. Her voice is absolutely incredible and the depth and uh, sincerity uh, and, and the vulnerability that she sings with is really, really, really tops. So I can't wait to see some of her like individual music, some of her own stuff. Today we're looking at uh, Chinchilla singing Fingers live for Hunger TV. This is something that some of her fans have been requesting since I reacted to her before, so I thought I would finally get to it. You're welcome. Let's jump into this right now. If you're watching this on YouTube, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Leave me a comment in the comment section down below. Check the description for all my social media links, including a link to the Patreon, Discord. Different ways to support the channel means the world. Also, if you get a chance, hop down into the comments. If you don't have anything to say, just throw in your favorite emoji. It really does do a lot to help boost the videos, get it out to more people. Let YouTube know that you guys are enjoying what you're watching. With all that said and done, let's jump into this. This is again Chinchilla singing Fingers live for Hunger TV. I have no idea what to expect, but I'm excited. Dramatic and suspense. Suspense is the, 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 the word of the day here. Probably saw me let go. Panicked and you said hello. Swallowing the words you say. You know I'm not okay. I just need a second. <laughs> First of all, obviously the vocals are beautiful. I, I really love the sort of unorthodox way she attacks some of these phrases and the way she comes off of some of the phrases. Tell me if I'm crazy here or, or is it too on the nose? I kind of get like Tim Burton vibes. I'm, I'm a little bit reminded of Sweeney Todd uh, and just sort of the tone of it is a little fantastical. It's a little, a little bit over the top and expressing things in, in this really sort of like over dramatized and, and really uh, ornate, elaborate way. But the things that it's expressing in this really big and, like I said, ornate way are very base, plain, direct ideas. Like the concept is wild and sort of big and, and, and dramatic, but the message is very clear to me. It's very plain. She's delivering it with such intensity and focus. Like everything about her is completely wrapped up in delivering this performance, all the little expressions, the little, just the little curls of, of, of her lip, the, the way her eyes focus and, and draw back as she sings, the way she's using her hands and her body. And of course her voice, all the little, like I said, unorthodox things she's doing with her voice. They're all painting this picture of someone who is communicating a very clear message, but who has maybe been pushed to the brink, pushed past the uh, barriers of civility beyond the, the realm of platitude, beyond being polite and kind and putting on the face really into that area of now that's it. I've gone to, you've broken it. Like I'm, I'm, you've pushed me too far. Now I'm just going to let out all of this frustration, the, the fears and anxieties, the desires and passions, everything's going to come out and you're just going to have to deal with it. Cause frankly, I'm tired of holding it all in. There's a real sense 
of an unleashing happening. And I don't think it's actually happened yet, but I kind of feel it coming. Does that make sense? Like, I don't think we've really hit that big moment yet where the all of that repressed emotion just sort of explodes. I don't think we've gotten there yet, but it's certainly bubbling and boiling. It's been foreshadowed. So I'm really excited to see how it goes and and where this story leads and, and how that sort of eruption happens. Beautiful job, uh, Miss Chinchilla. This is absolutely gorgeous. You are a rock star. This is incredible. And this piano. Okay, sing it. So much Maybe power. I should shed a tear Cause this was me last year So mean me Late at night Where no one hears us I won't bite And one by one I'll cut your fingers clean off So you can never pull Look at that expression. One by one, I'll box them up, scream murder. Oh, so that was so good. Wait, I gotta go back. Gotta go back. Hold on. One, I'll box them up, scream murder. So you can never hurt no one. You'll hear the word growl said over and over again in reaction videos or anytime somebody's critiquing a, a musical performance where a singer will, you know, adds a little grit, little gruffness to the voice. But that right there, that, that wasn't like, oh, someone singing and, and crooning out this beautiful note and putting a little rasp on it. That was a growl. That was like from a wild animal, like from someone that's burying their teeth and ready to bear down. That is a fierce animalistic, aggressive growl that was beautiful. And everything about her, from the way her face contorted to the way her leg came up and then the way she scrunched herself up, it, it was all her. She did it with her whole body. And the more I'm watching this, the more excited I'm getting because it's really, it's just, it's painting this really clear picture. I mean, <laughs> there's definitely some, I don't know if grief is the right word. There's some pain behind the motivation for this message that she's delivering for the the place that she's in, for the decisions that she's made and the plan that she has to move forward with in the song, there are some hurt back there. And that's also really plain, which is probably the most impressive things about her performance so far is the way that kind of subtlety is layered in for context underneath the aggression and the wild eyed expressions, the sort of mad Again, I'm about to erupt and let this all loose. You go on, call me crazy, call me nuts, call me insane. Call me wild. I'm going to do what I came here to do today. And and underneath all of that, there is some pain. And it's really apparent to me, but it's incredibly subtle. And I just, it's just a really, it's a beautiful job. I'm, I'm really impressed by this. Box them up, scream murder. So you can never hurt no So keep them close to you. 
Wait, what, what, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Not the camp. That can't be all of it. I really hope that this is off of an album. <laughs> I, 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 I wasn't enough. It wasn't enough. I wanted more, man. I still want more. Uh, that was, it was marvelously done. It was marvelously done. Again, there were so many subtleties layered into that performance. Physically, you could feel the intention behind the message, behind the sort of plan. Sure, there was anger and sort of a sense of vengeance and rage and righteous indignation, a lot of passion, a wildness, a little bit of crazy, right? But again, underneath all that was very real trauma, like hurt, pain, um, anxiety, a sense of resentment. I It was really, it was really good. It was really good. I'm really glad I had a chance to listen to that. Thank you so much for all of you who were requesting it over and over and over again. And just in case you do ever happen to see this, uh, Chinchilla, thank you so much for the comment. It did, it did kind of give me the push I needed uh, when I saw it to do this reaction. And I'm really grateful. I'm incredibly grateful. That was such a good performance. That was so, so, so good. Uh, I, I, I need to, I don't know. I, I haven't even looked. I need to look and see what else there is out there that I can take a look of look at look at from her because I think that she has I think that she has something really special to offer. That's that was really incredible. Uh I I feel um I don't know. I feel like I, I just got to witness something kind of rare. And um I'm trying to find another way to say it besides I'm I feel like it like or that I'm I'm trying to find another way to say it besides it was an honor to be able to share in that moment because it sounds really corny and cheesy but I can't think of another word that works so there you go uh, all that being said thank you so much for tuning in with me I, I hope that you enjoyed this as much as I do uh, let me know if there's any other chinchilla songs that I should definitely check out please let me know in the comments uh, I, I, do, I after this I've got to check out at least one more uh, let me know I'm gonna look I'll look for it but you guys let me know is this part of an album does she have a studio album out uh, does she have an ep let me know what's going on with her as an artist uh thank you so much once again for being here please remember as always to be kind to each other and most importantly be kind to yourself <laughs>